My vision for hope is that um, our children and grandchildren will be equipped with the, the necessary knowledge and skills that they need in order to succeed in their future lives. The wealth of information that our elders have left us uh, and the tools not the and the tools that they have left us, not in a physical sense, but in a, a cultural, spiritual, and um, uh, handing down of the wisdom of how to survive, I think will help us continue on with who we are. So really, to me, the things that I think about that are hopeful are, are working on things that last, and that's, that's children um, and young people. Um, and then certainly, you know, doing everything that we can to protect our most important teachers, and that's the elders in the land. Part of what being Native is, is giving back to your community. Um, and I think I say that because as an, as an off-reservation Indian, it's really, it can be really, you have to really strive in some ways to reconnect back to your culture. Something that uh, my father used to tell me years ago before he passed on is that this changing world that we're in, you know, the white society, you know, coming into our country. And, uh, and what he would talk about was that we need to be one people. And what this meant is that being one people, you do not take things away from each other. You do not steal from each other. And you do not kill each other. You accept your neighbor as uh, a neighbor and not try to change him or take something away from him. So then you become one people. If we can take what our ancestors, our, our elders in the past have uh, established for us in the form of a land base and uh, teach our future generations how to manage that, how to utilize that uh, to be self-sustaining. Uh, the self-sustaining aspect of, uh, of our people I think is the most important element for us to uh, continue and exist in the world as it's shaping to be today. There's more work that needs to be done in terms of native uh, healing, uh, health and wellness because many of the issues that we face in Indian country today have to do with revitalization and reclaiming who we are as a people. We're here to live together and be one people. That's what this concept means. Remembering the past and planning for the future and using the tools that the elders have given us in the form of wisdom, I think is where I see the hope for us to continue.